time, there lived a beautiful girl named Jane. She was very kind. She lived on a huge island named Crossbow. She had a little puppy and her garden was filled with the scent of fresh flowers. So, in the above description of Jane, you might have noticed some words like beautiful, kind, huge, etc. What are these words? Are they called something special? Yes, the words which describe a noun or pronoun are called adjectives. Now, there are even six different kinds of adjectives. Adjective of quality, adjective of quantity, adjective of number, demonstrative adjectives, possessive adjectives and interrogative adjectives. This is a cute teddy bear. The word cute here describes the quality of the bear. This is the adjective of quality. We can also take some other examples like this is a small book and this is a pink umbrella. The words which describe the quality, material, texture, shape, size, color, etc. of a noun or a pronoun are called adjectives of quality. I have four bangles. Here I am describing the number of bangles I am having. The words will describe the amount of uncountable or countable nouns are known as adjective of quantity. I am so happy that I came first in my class. Hmm. Let me use my rank to demonstrate what are adjective of numbers. Adjective of numbers are the numbers which show the number or order of a noun or a pronoun. Like first is my number in the class. Now they are themselves divided into two categories. First, definite and second, indefinite. Hmm, I'm having two mangoes and who doesn't like mangoes? The number of mangoes I'm having is definite, which is two. So they are called definite adjective of numeral. I am having sugar in my hand. Is the quantity of sugar known? No, the quantity of sugar is unknown. And when the quantity of a noun or a pronoun is unknown, they are called indefinite adjective of numerals. The adjectives which are used to point a noun or a pronoun are called demonstrative adjectives. For example, this is a unicorn. That is a bike. We can also use these and those depending on the number of noun or pronoun. My uniform is looking really nice today. Now my hair is showing the ownership of the uniform. The adjectives which show the ownership of a noun or a pronoun are called possessive adjectives. For example, mine, yours, his, hers, theirs, etc. When you interrogate something, you ask questions about it, right? Interrogative adjectives are exactly the same. When you ask questions about a noun or a pronoun starting with a WH family word, they are called interrogative adjectives. For example, which pencil do you like? Which house do you live in? Etc. 